kiss for you. Bismillah Rahman Rahim. Welcome to my another video on Android app development and so guys this will be the part 5 and the last part of my video series on mini quiz app using Firebase in Android Studio. Alright guys so in this video uh, I will first of all show you the output of our app and after that we will try to complete the app by having the timer here uh, and also we will implement the quiz I mean the result activity okay so before that I wanted to show you an error uh, so here we needed to um, increment the, the total and here we will say set it if the total is, is greater than 4 because we have 4 questions in our uh, database okay since if we have uh, 100 questions so we can say 100 okay but since in this uh, scenario we have 4 case so now let me try to run the app and try to show you the output of our app so now our application is running here we have uh, the the question so if i answer it wrong so you are able to see this red and green and after that there is uh, tcp using which could uh, uh, let me uh, say it correct then we have we find the odd one out and here you go okay so now the application is here since there are four questions let me see all right so now what we are going to do is we are going to uh, have the increment the, the timer inside our android so now here we can create a new method called public void diverse timer and inside that me method we can use new countdown timer and okay so before that it will have take two things first one will be the seconds and the other one will be techview tv and inside that we can first of all have seconds and we can say thousand plus okay so before that let me see what is the code i have forgotten sorry guys okay so i will just try to uh, new okay i will just copy that and paste it here and now finally we need to have okay so here what we are doing is we are having uh, converting the timer to seconds and minutes then we are uh, setting it and after that on inside our own finish i mean when the timer is finished so now what we will do is we will open the result activity and we will send the total number of questions of uh, variable then we will also send the correct and the wrong answer and then we will start the activity so for that let's try to create a new activity and name it as result activity all right so now inside our result activity we are going to have okay so here we let's try to change the layout to relative layout here we will have two edit text uh, text views all right let's set the id to
total questions then here we will have correct answers and then we will have wrong answers so here it will have text 4 5 6 okay so here inside our test first of all let's initialize the text views let's copy that four five and six all right so after that we are going to uh, receive the value so for that we can use intent i equal to get intent and after that we can have bundle okay before that we can say string questions equal to i dot get string extra and here we can pass let's say it was total correct and incorrect similarly we can have and instead of question we can say correct wrong all right so here we can set the questions then we can send the t2 dot set text correct and finally t3 dot set text wrong all right guys so now let's try to run the app and okay before that we needed to call the timer method time uh, reverse uh, reverse timer and before that we have reverse timer then we have number of seconds let's say we have uh, we give user 30 seconds and we timer text all right guys so before that let's try to check okay so here we need to have the user permission of internet and after that let's try to run the app and let's see the final output alright guys so now the application is running and here you can see the timer is now running let's go back and let's try to run the app again okay you can see that it is not displaying the question number one so for that we can simply set the total to zero all right and after that inside our if part here we are going to call the activity and we can finally start activity before that we need to pass the variable so we can say i dot put extra total similarly correct and finally we can say incorrect dot value of wrong 
all right so guys i hope you have learned something from this uh, video series so let's now try to run the app and now you are able to see the question number one and the timer is here so let's i select this correct answer then i select this and then we have this the session layer and the last question is pop and after that you go directly and here you can see total question five correct answer two and wrong answers two all right so guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe goodbye